hello guys welcome to my channel I just like to show you the progress that has been made on the General Motors half-ton trucks that uh, autopilot is operational you can see that it's raining pretty hard right now and autopilot is uh, doing lane changes for me and it's steering for me I'm not touching the steering wheel. You can see that right now we're using the laneless mode. It seems to catch the actual lanes better than the, uh, when it's using lane mode because the lane lines here are really bad here in Alberta. So I'm currently in a 2020 GMC Sierra 84. Um, it does have the adaptive cruise and lane key assist. Open Pilot will use the factory adaptive cruise to maintain distance in front of your vehicle, but it will steer for you. In this case, we do have to keep the lane departure warning assist disabled, otherwise it will constantly tell you to keep your hands on the wheel. Right now, uh, we do have one of the IRs uh, light blocked off because it was tripping the rear view mirror thinking that it's daylight so it's not dimming my mirrors when the vehicle is behind me so far everything's working great it is a combination of few members on the community that is working uh, skip on discord he has been a great help uh, i had to get my harness from Tiny Bear. He has a Etsy shop. Also, I believe he also has an eBay listing as well. Depending on which method, payment method you prefer, uh, they are available on both platforms. So you just need to get the harness. I will tap into the factory camera, split into the little black harness box that comes back to a Type C cable that goes directly to the camera or open pilot comma three here this unit we're plugged into you will load up the dev dash either the stable or a uh, few other variations that has skipped fingerprint it should work with this particular vehicle because i didn't have to do any fingerprinting it just worked out of the box right now i am running the dev dash broken as of today and it seems to be working pretty much flawlessly for what I use it for. I mainly need it for the highway driving and that's most of my commute uh, going to work and coming home and this is actually part of the road that I have to take to go home. You can see that uh, I can do a lane change right now, do a little tug, it's gonna do a lane change for me. I did the convenience uh, signals so that way it just stops signaling after a few seconds a gentle tug while the signal signaling is uh, in process will allow the open pilot to assist you in the steering you can see that i have the rear view mirror cameras working i do have a little trailer plug plugged in to uh, fake the the signal to make the vehicle think there's a trailer plugged in so the camera can be on for the rear view mirrors as well as when I use uh, signals the blind spot cameras will come on. This greatly helps when you're using open pilot to do lane changes. For example, right now if I do lane change, you're going to see the blind spot is clear. So I tuck the steer wheel and it's going to change the lane for me. And we're going to do it again. Just signal right, tuck the right side here and it's going to change the lane back for me. It's like super dark outside right now and open pilot can clearly see the lines even though it's not using them but it obviously means that it can see the road just fine. I hope that this video is informative. If you guys have any questions feel free to give me a shout back and uh, I can answer some of your questions if needed. And I hope more of you will come on board and we can make this tuning even better. So far it's already great but we will make it better. Thank you. Have a nice day.